do my dance, yeah. yeah, yeah. And you know I'm getting bands, yeah. yeah. Billy bounce in my pants, yeah. Yeah, somebody coming. What's up, guys? OG Ninja here. You know I'm rocking. Back with another banker. Man, I haven't posted in three weeks. In three weeks? I'm gonna tell y'all why. Because my phone is broken. I don't even know how. But my phone is broken. It just keeps turning on and off. And my other phone doesn't even want to turn on. I have two phones in it. Both don't work. That don't make no sense. But hopefully we can get a fixed man. That's why I haven't been posting in a long time. But y'all be like, wait, what? How did you post it out? I want my tablet. My dad tablet. My dad tablet. But yeah, bro. Oh my God, let's get it started, man. We finna be reacting to a horror story, y'all. We finna be doing three uploads today, boy. So, we're gonna be doing True Macy's Store Horror. Wait, what? Sorry, y'all. So, we're gonna be reacting to True Macy's, True Macy's Store Horror Story animated. And you already know it gotta be animated. You already know. But yeah, guys, we're gonna be reacting to a lot of different stuff. We're gonna be start back reacting to Jeffy. You already know Jeffy. You already know Jeffy. And I got some new headphones, man. Let's get it, man. You know what I said. You know what I said. You know. Look it. Look it. But yeah, guys, let's get it started. Hey, make sure y'all guys like and subscribe. You know what I'm saying. A few days you know ago, saying? I went to a Macy's store with my mother and son. To go check Macy's? out some jewelry. While my Macy's? mom was checking out jewelry, I noticed an old man around his 50s come near us. He was about eight it feet was good to be back. At first, I thought he was just a random customer checking something out for his lady or something. Back. Then, from the corner of my eye, I noticed oh God, he was ugly. just standing there without moving and looking at us. It made me feel uncomfortable. So I turned around, moving the stroller, which my toddler was in, because was I didn't want him looking at my baby. I turned my eyes to look at him again, and I could see that he was just staring at me with a creepy look. He was staring at me and my baby. Then all of a sudden, he grinned widely at us. The weirdest thing about him was that he was wearing women's shoes and a scarf and heck? also holding a dress in his hand. He opened his mouth and tried to say something. I couldn't hear what he was saying, but I could read his lips. What? I like you. I like your baby. I just thought the man was a weirdo. And then my mom That's also me. noticed that right, he was odd and Sorry creepy. He saw that my mom was glaring at what? him, so he walked away. But then he appeared on the opposite side of us and started staring at what? me again. This time he pulled his phone out and made it seem like he was about to take a picture. He was staring at us and his eyes opened widely. <laughs> he was smiling like a crazy psychopath. That was enough. I wanted to go up to him and tell him to get away from us, but I had my boy with me and didn't want anything to happen, so I chose to just get out of there. I told a lady who was working there what happened. She said that she would go take a look at him. A few minutes later, she came back and told us that he was a customer who has been reported before by other people. My mom asked, why hasn't he been kicked out then? The lady said, well, because he hasn't threatened or hurt anyone, so the store doesn't have a good enough reason to kick him out. My mom and I were pissed off because obviously the man is just there to harass people. The lady then told us that he said something creepy to her and also made her uncomfortable. She told us that when she went to go ask him what he was up to, he told her that he went to the store to return a dress. He decided that he didn't like that he bought it for his lady. He told her with a smile. Yeah, I need to change quickly because she's cold now. My mom and I instantly felt so creeped out, so we just Whoa. left. What did that mean? Could he have been hiding a dead body back at his place? A few days later, and I feel relieved that the crazy guy didn't harm us. But I'm still wondering what he meant by 
She's cold now. Hey, yo, that was a good reaction. Hey, that place is kind of scary. Like, no, cat, bruh. Actually, kind of scary. No, cat, bruh. But make sure you guys like and subscribe this video, man. I'm finna go film another video, man. And it's finna be Jeffy, man. So let's get it. Peace.